we're just coming up to Sarah's Island here in the Grand River. Uh, floating down the river today was Jamie Kent from Grand Experiences. This is a little view back of this uh, large and uh, important heritage river in uh, southern Ontario. And on this side here, just wanted to show you, I'll probably grab it from the other side, is Sarah's Island. Um, Sarah's Island, tell me a little bit about Sarah's Island and what it is, Jamie. Well, Sarah's Island is one of the larger islands in the Grand River. Uh huh. And um, it's named Sarah for a native woman who lived here back in the 80s and 90s. So, so, so very recently? Yep, yep. Mm -hmm. And, and she's the mother of one of your your river guides, right? Yeah, yeah. Our, our our crew boss and then one of our main fishing guide and mm -hmm. uh, Neil Demaria. It's his mother, but uh, she lived here back uh, from about you know May to October for, mm -hmm. for like a dozen years. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, lived, lived on the island. Her family would bring her supplies and uh -huh. stuff, you know, uh -huh. and, you know, harvest some things. But she would live in a traditional native way, living off the land, essentially. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. we were probably the last person, native person, living off the land in mm -hmm. this area, Ontario, mm -hmm. sure. And uh, she was well respected. A lot of people really liked Sarah. Yeah. Uh, and she died in '97, and they still have a memorial for her on the island. Oh, really? Yeah. You can see it's quite a large island. It is a large it's island, yeah. Let me give you a look Ooh. down the river here. And uh, you can't see the end of it. Oh, it yeah. continues. So yeah. we, are, we are actually just surrounded by an island and the bank, the right-hand yep. bank on the other side. We're just in the channel here between the two. Uh-huh, okay. Cool. And what uh, what comes up after Sarah's Island? Well, we're going to go head down towards Brant Conservation Area. Uh-huh. Pass down. We are going to need, pass a neat area where there remains an old corduroy road. Or again, where they had the uh, gypsum mines used to come through. Oh yeah. They would use a quarter road, which is a roadway of logs laid side by side mm -hmm. along the river mm -hmm. to get the, uh, the the mine material out. Uh huh. And, uh, and it's interesting that well over 150 years later, the remains of that road are still there. Oh really? Cool. Excellent. Thank you.